Hello world, I'm Golcarp, and welcome once again to Neo Scavenger, where once again we're just gonna do a random run without any particular idea. Ooh, that just immediately gave us uh, all the points we So we're fragile and we're insomniac. That's fine, we're strong. We're good at hiding, we got melee, we got eagle eye, we got trapping, tracking and trapping and electrician. Okay, this is actually, this. Is, okay, we're gonna survive with this for sure. At least longer than we did in the previous two runs. So, okay. And yeah, we are here in this cryo facility. We just got out of tank number five. We hear something bad coming. So, we're gonna use our strong and melee to prepare to kick its ass. And we seriously kick the dogman's ass. And uh, we actually kill it. Because we're so damn good. And then we're gonna do some tracking and find out that hey, something has moved here in the past 24 hours. We're gonna check out uh, the console for records and find out that hey, we are Philip Kindred. Okay, and out of the window we go. Okay, so we got here a dogman corpse. And we got here security footage of you kicking a dogman's ass with your bare hands. Which is kind of fun. Okay, let's see if we cut this. Oh, we have trapping and tracking. So that should mean that we have the better skill uh, to do this. Is it okay? It's trapping that we need to use. Yeah, meet and hide from a dogman corpse and the dogman fur coat. So we're gonna do this. This is basically the best start you can have in the game if you manage to get this dogman fur coat. And we're gonna take the security footage. We're gonna take some shots. All right, we're of course going to use our eagle eye here because that actually gives us a multi-tool condition 10.5 it's not in very good condition uh, but yeah we're gonna take it instead of the shot we're really nice to eat some of this meat but uh, it's hardly ever does that happen we're just gonna use our strength oh got some some allergies happening there okay oh doggo oh doggo 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 well we oh man we're frail, but we're also strong. So if we manage to hit the dog, we're gonna do good damage. But if the dog manages hit us, uh, that's not gonna be so good. Okay, so we're gonna use the multi tool and try to stab the dog. Just wait here. Oh wait, the dog. Oh, the dog tripped. Oh, I didn't even. Did I? Oh, I must have. I didn't even think we had made any turn. What did I do? So the. Did I do nothing? Okay, well, we're gonna see if we can lure the dog into something. So it's frail, recovering, coughing up blood. Let's advance a bit. Let's lure it again. Oh, no, it's fallen, vulnerable. Okay, let's charge and stick it with the multi-tool. Okay, it's in severe pain. Let's stick it again. Okay, now it's in shock and unconscious, so we'll just uh, advance and kick it until it is dead. Okay, sometimes you can't kick them, which is like I've never figured out why. Okay, we could. Yeah, we're gonna cut this dog as well. Uh, yep, get some chunks of fur. Uh, we're actually just going to destroy our hospital gown, and then with those small chunks of fur and that we're gonna do a patchwork hide a glove okay would be really nice to find a bag of some sort oh well there's something oh an olive color hoodie well, that's nice we can put something in here like the security footage and uh, we're gonna eat the blinkies oh creamy can hmm Oh, shoe type thing, we will put that on. I'd really like to put something else in here as well. Oh, we're gonna take the ketchup. Right, and let's keep on looking. Oh, that's locked. Mm. Well, there's something here. Maybe we can find, because... Uh... Oh, that's locked as well. Anything that... Ooh, shoes! Also, shirts. I would probably need to really like to put on some shirts as well. Okay, hey, here we got some bags as well. Okay. 98% uh, plastic bag. That's good. We're gonna grab that. We're gonna grab some of those small parts. We're gonna grab some dirty rags. Uh, Alright. 
gonna put the first one on the face, of course. Uh, I don't think we're gonna take anything else from here. Uh, we're gonna see if we can find something good from here, and uh, we're gonna go back here because there was some good stuff here, like this soup. And uh, oh, it's an actually functional. How much power does it have? For 13 hours, yeah, actually functional flashlight. That's very nice. Uh, let's get a couple more of those small things. Uh, wait, we have another plastic bag. We can actually just take it, take uh, that. I'm gonna take the small fur now. Because if we find another dog, we can then just use like we can. <laughs> if we kill the dog, we'll get enough to make another glove. Uh, should we try that maybe? Okay, what is the condition of our multi-tool? 8.5. It was so we used like 10 2% of its uh, condition. So let's start by creating obstacle. It's fallen and it's recovering and bleeding. Let's advance. It's still fallen. Let's stick it. Okay, we hit it. Uh, let's stick it again. Okay, it's fallen. Uh, did it hit us? It did not. Okay, good. Right, uh, let's just uh, charge at it and create an obstacle and create an obstacle and charge and stick it. Okay, now it's unconscious, so we'll just advance and advance and uh, wait and kick it and kick it and kick it until it is dead. I need this dog to be dead. Come on. Right now. Come on. Uh, okay, thank you. Right, so we are going to cut it. Do we have any shards here? Well, we're gonna have to use our knife. Cut it so that we get more of the fur. Fur in there, and do we not have any strings here? No, we don't have any strings here, so get some more of that. Like so, and now we have another club. Nice! <laughs> wow, we're... We're in a very good spot right now. Because uh, we're not taking much damage with all of this gear on. Pants would be pretty nice to find. Better backpacks immediately, of course, are always nice. Okay, do we have anything that will allow us to go in here? No. Okay. Uh, there are some high-rise buildings. Let's go check them out. Mm. Water. Not gonna just grab extra water at this point because we're not dying of thirst this time. Immediately. Okay, a metal saucepan. Actual shoes. Actual pants. Yeah, and with the top. Okay, so we're gonna break down this t-shirt, we're gonna make a medium thread, and with the top and the medium thread we can make a makeshift sack. And in that makeshift sack we can take the metal saucepan, I'll uh, take a handful of small twigs, okay they don't need to go there, let's put the soup and the uh, flashlight over there. Uh, no, we don't really need any of this other stuff over here. Uh, can we make a little fire? Mm, no, we don't have anything that we can use to start a fire here. And we have a lot of things that would be useful to starting a fire, but not the, the we do not have the things that we actually need to start a fire. Yeah, don't have a lighter, don't have anything that we can use to create fire from the sun. Shack in the forest. Oh! There's a lighter. Okay, that was really... Uh, 20. Okay, that's in better condition than the one we're wearing. Come on. Put it on. And since we're in the forest, let's get some wood. Let's start a fire. We didn't start the fire. Yes, we did. And then we can boil some water. I think there was... What? 
Rust water boiled. Oh! If we don't have uh, enough water, uh, it doesn't work. Okay, wait. Game, what are you trying to do? Okay, something silly. Just drink that. And... yep. Get over here. Oh, locked. And unlocked. Nice. There's a couple there. Oh, condition 8.4. So every time we use it, uh, we lose one percentage from it. So I don't think I'm gonna be using that for uh, scavenging. Oh! Well, this is nice. Ooh, we can get some water over here. Uh, okay, take that. Take that, put the multi tool in here. And take the crowbar in hand. Uh, let's grab the torches as well. Which torches are useful. Uh, okay, anything else? Alright, uh, that was locked. We don't want to go there. I don't want to kill the doggo. There's no reason to really. Oh, we're getting tired. Uh, and I don't want to go to Zom Zoms. I don't know, for some reason, I just. I'm not even sure why. Like, that's probably the best thing always, just to go straight to Zom Zoms and get the stuff from there by uh, giving the information, hoping you get something good from there. Uh, but, I don't know. I just. For some, I just don't like doing it. Ooh! Top. We'll grab that for sure. Uh, I'll take those shots as well. Wait, what were our skills this time? Oh, we're still we're an electrician as well. Well, that's fun. Uh, that's locked. Okay, so let's see if we can find something good from here. Uh, Bandit mobile home strong. Get stuck. I mean, be nice. Oh my god, I'm such an, I'm such a fool. Ah, I have a crowbar. The fact that that. Oh, come on. Yeah, the fact that this place was locked here didn't mean a thing. Cause I have a crowbar. Okay, let's. Mm, weapon bow, greenwood. Shop edge range skill. Okay. I don't think I've ever actually made. Oh, a bow. Have I? Doggo! Seriously, you do not want to bother me. As soon as you get close enough, I will just smack you with my crowbar and you are gonna die. Okay. Wait. And melee attack. Yep, stunned immediately, bleeding immediately. Hit it again. Yeah, unable to run, fallen, severe pain. Hit it again. Shocked and unconscious. And then just move closer and kick it to death. Huh. I'm thinking of maybe, 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 maybe taking that dog somewhere where we could then eat it, cook it, and eat it. Okay, now I'm gonna be using. Using the lighter for sure, since we found another one. Uh, we'll take the other top. What is your condition? 42. Uh, that's better condition than our current crowbar. So we're just gonna uh, destroy this crowbar so that no one can find it and use it against us. Uh, we got some water here. Do we have... We have one bottle. Uh, okay, but what we can do is get some of this water out here. Go for next turn. I'm pretty sure we got enough stuff to make a small fire. Uh, small campfire lit. Yes, uh, please use the correct one. You did. And then with that small campfire, we can boil some water. Let's boil a couple of waters. Uh, we'll take sterilized water with us. And then we will drink the rest of the sterilized water. There should be more. Yeah, there's some more. At least we won't be dying of thirst. Okay, uh... Well, the main part of the game is going towards Detroit, so maybe we'll start going towards Detroit. Then again, I'd really just like to go to Detroit, like, the long way around. 
You know what? Let's see if we can do do that. Because, like I said, we're in a pretty okay-ish start at this point. Ooh, and we found some other good stuff. So, oh, yeah, I think this is this is this is going to be fine. Wow. Okay. Uh. <laughs> Sometimes the game just decides to be really nice to you. Like this is basically too nice. What is the condition of our all of colored hoodie? Thirty nine. There was one that was eighty something. Uh, black cargo pants that are in better condition than our cargo pants. So we'll take them for sure. Got stuff in there, that stuff in there, this stuff in here, this back on, we'll get that. How much is this worth? Not a lot. Uh, are we hurt? We are not. I'm gonna still take the first aid kit though. Uh, we can put some stuff in there. Oh, should have really boiled the rags while I was at the place where we could boil the rags. Uh, let's put the uh, security footage in there. Okay. Is any of this stuff something that I need? Well, we're gonna take bottles for sure. Oh, this one's got actual stuff in it. Okay, let's move this stuff down here. Let's put the bottles up here. Like so, take some water. Uh, rifle scope. Oh, it's with a strap. Nice. Uh, so we can actually put it on our neck. Uh, any of this other stuff? Anything we need? Well, we should start collecting scraps of foil at this point, maybe. Uh, strings would be good. Like this medium length of string. Can we somehow get that in? Uh. We have the multi-tool, so we don't need shards. Okay, let's start with that. Uh, okay, if we put these things over here and this thing over there, then we can grab the medium length of string. Okay, good. Uh, we'll grab the plastic bag, just in case. I mean, a couple of them. Honestly, that's just so poor condition, I don't really even want that. And we'll grab those recipes. I'd uh, truly really like to take the small string as well. But we don't have enough space. <sighs> Honestly, yeah, we can get more scrap of foil. Because the, the scrap of foil is something we need for the really end game. As uh, string is something that can be helpful. Even in the early game. Okay, yeah, I don't think we need anything else from here. So, next turn. Uh, I think if we go here, we're just gonna have... Okay, I'm thinking we would only have one movement left, but... Oh, so that's good. Okay, another makeshift bag. Just flashlight. Okay, those aren't very useful for us right now. Let's go here. First, scavenge this uh, worse location. And then scavenge in the better location, cause uh, just feels like a better idea to, to do it that way. Okay, uh, you get some cornacola in you, you get some water in you, so we're gonna put the water in this. And change the bottles. Okay, uh, the recipes. Really kind of like to take the bottles, but we do not have the space. I mean, you get rid of the torches. And then one bottle. Ah, it's not that important. Oh, a melon head. Okay. Let's sneak towards the lemon head. Melon head. Yeah, we'll just sneak towards him. Okay, he's trying to hide. We'll sneak towards him a bit more. And then we'll smack him! We missed! Oh, come on! He hadn't even seen us, right? 
Oh, he might have just seen us. Well, we're just gonna keep hitting him because he is... Honestly, if we just hit him... Oh, let's trip him. Yeah, melon heads aren't a danger, really. I mean, maybe they are. Oh, he's unconscious, so we'll just advance and kick him to death. Because that's just what you do. Oh, we're getting weary. Come on, where's my kick? There's my kick. Okay, let's just hit him with the crowbar so he'll die. Okay, humanoid corpse. Nothing useful there. Okay, ooh. Gas stations have all been drained of their liquid gold. This one may have been empty before the crash, but by the looks of it. Barely any working cars left to tell whether gas or fuel cells were the mainstay. The pumps are still there, though. A man in a tattered filthy suit is chained to the nearest one. Calls out to you to free him. Says they've left him like this. He's worried the crows will peck out his eyes once they figure out he's immobile. Pinned to his chest is a sign in big visible letters. Don't judge. Property of Martha's army. You ask him what he did to upset them. Had a trolley full of ice lamps. Was taking them to the market, he replies. Peculiar tone of voice. Equal parts indignant, proud and demanding. You get the feeling that he's trouble. Steal his shoes. Walk on. Talk to him. Find out more about his situation. Help if it's, if it's warranted. Yeah, let's talk to him. Oh, my right arm was whipped. What? You try to talk to him, but the con conversation isn't reassuring. Mostly threats. He knows people. They'll come after you. He's an important official of an enclave. Why aren't you helping him? His family has a long memory. You say little, taking it all in. Eventually, you ask him if he'd like you to help. A simple plea would have sufficed. Maybe even a reply in the affirmative. But no, more threats. Nothing but hassle, this one. As you leave, he viciously kicks out and catches you in the back of the knee. Caught of palance, you fall heavily onto the ground. You pick yourself up, the sign on his chest his only shield from your wrath. You hope that the limp isn't permanent. Well, crap. Now it's just minor bruising. Uh, but uh, we'll, we'll still bandage it. Just to be safe. Okay, and up to scavenging again. Oh, a lot of clothes. Okay, nothing useful this time. Oh, roof collapse. Well, luckily we got a lot of clean rags. Come on, just put it there and there and there. Hey, blinkies. We'll eat that. And. Really like to find a backpack right about now. That would be awesome to find a backpack right about now. But with my luck, we'll never find one. Uh, Seventy-four percent. What was ours? Eighty-three percent. Okay, ours is still better. Uh, tarps don't. Yeah, don't stack to more than three. Don't want jeans. Okay. Let's uh, get... Maybe we should actually stay here. We're, we're pretty weary. Maybe we should stay here and sleep. Yeah, this looks pretty good. I'm gonna sneeze soon. Yeah, let's see if we can build ourselves a top shelter. Do we have what is needed for that? Uh, it's in tools, tarp, shelter. Oh, we can use the uh, torches. Okay. Then again, do we... I mean... Shelter was already almost maxed out. Didn't maybe need to do those. Uh, can do we have the recipe for noise trap? We do. Uh, could we use this thing for the noise trap, please, instead of that thing? Right, and let's make another one as well. Because two of them is good. Uh, Okay, that's antibiotics, I believe. Uh, okay, let's use let's not use our antibiotics bottle, because uh, if we do, I'll most likely forget what the pills we had were. Okay, uh, yeah, I did. Let's just rest and heal here.
Oh, wait, I just rest and heal. No, we need to sleep, damn it. <gasps> oh, man, that was a kind of bad thing. Okay, let's sleep here. Okay, we woke up. That's fine. Uh, oh, one of our... Okay, our shoe broke. Yes. And our noise trap broke. Okay, that's interesting. Uh, let's uh, break down the top shelter. And let's break down the makeshift noise trap. Because I'm pretty sure we can't fit it in our inventory. Yeah. Grab those, grab the top, uh, grab some string, grab a handful of those, uh, grab more of that stuff. Okay, I think that's all we can take with us. Yep. Uh, we leave anything behind? Okay. Some little things. Okay, there is some spots to scavenge in. Oh, we're tired. We just finished sleeping. Oh, are we insomniacs? We are insomniacs, okay. Uh, but that's fine. We'll be tired for today because we forgot to sleep during the night. That's just how life goes sometimes. Sometimes you just forget to sleep. <laughs> okay. Oh, crap. Yep. Hurt. Uh, is that shoe the shoe we're missing? That is the shoe we're missing. Good. Uh, okay. Next turn. Got melon hits moving up there. But like I've said, they're not that much of a threat. Uh, rifle scope. Not in very good condition. Wait, are these in the exact same condition? No, there's a 0.5% difference. Okay, uh, what I'd really like to do is maybe get some, uh, you know what, there's some ketchup, let's eat the ketchup. Get some wood. We got wood there, so uh, we'll go to the forest and boil some of the water we got with us. Oh, another crowbar, is it better than our current one? 90! I think it's better than our current one. So we'll uh, destroy this. Wait, can we make a travois? Or do we have that skill? I never remember which skill you need for the travois. Uh, should be in tools, right? Oh, we know how to make a gauze rifle. Oh, with a scope. No, no, with a strap. Add a strap, I think, is the. Add a scope or add a strap. A Gauss rifle. I have never had a Gauss rifle in this game. Uh, now this looks like stuff we want to take with us. Oh, for the uh, we'll use the map. Okay, Detroit, as you do. And yeah, we're gonna grab the map with us. Because it's useful. Uh, grab some of the water, and yeah, let's head to the forest. And what we're gonna do here is uh, we're gonna see what we need for the squirrel snare. Okay, we can make a squirrel snare. Okay, that's good. So let's get. Oh, there's water in here as well. Well, that's nice. Let's get some wood and water out. Let's make a squirrel snare. Ah, confirm that. Let's make a small camp. Fire. We go to straight straight to medium campfire. Yes, we can. So let's make a medium campfire actually, and then we shall scavenge here with the squirrel snare. Uh, strong and light. Okay, found a lot of squirrels. So next turn, let's uh, butcher these squirrels. Uh, where's our knife? Third squirrel, there's a knife. Uh, we probably want to use the 
chopping skill as well. Yep. Confirm, confirm, confirm. And uh, then we'll cook the meat. Confirm, confirm, confirm. Let's eat the meat. Then uh, let's boil some water. No recipes, food, boil, water, times three. Let's do this a couple of times. Uh, where's our sterilized water now? Ooh. Let's empty out all of these bottles. You know what, let's drink the corn cola away. Okay, that's sterilized, we'll grab that. Uh, that's sterilized, we'll grab that. That's sterilized, we'll grab that. That's sterilized, we'll grab that. Uh, there's gotta be some more sterilized water here that we can just drink. Yes. Okay, and then uh, let's boil some rags. Uh, that's gotta be in tools. Is it? Misc? Medic. Okay. What? We can make use the small animal hides for this. I did not know that. That is. Oh, we don't have enough moves left. That's the entire few of our moves. That's fine. We'll just okay, go away. We'll put this here. We'll put that there. Uh, ten of them is probably good enough. And hey, it looks like this movie. Uh, movie. <laughs> episode has been going on for or half an hour now so we're gonna put a cut in here and continue with this in the next episode i'm gokarp this is me neo scavenger goodbye world thanks for watching see you next time